it's it's devastating. There's always that rock hanging over the edge. You're just waiting for it to fall before it gets propped up. You know, it's you know you're almost thinking it's just a matter of time for the inevitable. Bobby's family is not about to accept the inevitable. In fact, it was his mom, Don's strong instincts as a mother and a nurse that helped save their child's life. Bobby's mom was monitoring a mole uh, that was just below his stomach when she observed growth where the, where the leg meets the torso. So that's when we went into the hospital for x-rays and stuff. And that's when they started debating that it was a, a possible tumor of some sort. Non-Hodgkin's B-cell lymphoma. Um, I'm not exactly sure what all that means, but I, I do know it's a very aggressive cancer. Um, if left untreated for too long, it, it is fatal. How old is your boyfriend? He's six years old. A little bit of an age difference, 14 years, but uh, it's okay. You been burping. You don't even want to hear the book, do you? No. My girlfriend. Never. <laughs> <laughs> She's reading me books. She's bringing me donuts. The sprinkles on it. <laughs> this relationship between Catherine McManus of the Notre Dame women's lacrosse team and Bobby did not happen by chance. The Fighting Irish Fight for Life program recruits pediatric cancer patients to be true members of Notre Dame athletic teams. I, I, I guess I was kind of expecting, you know, maybe attending a game or two and things like that, but. Um, the contact has just been phenomenal, you know, always on top of things, going to games, not just their own games and stuff, but, you know, being able to attend basketball and hockey games with them, the visits to the hospital, you know, it's the things like that, that, you know, the, the, the going the above and beyond, you know, it's, it's touching, it is. We got bingo. We got bingo in this world. Yeah, we love it. I beated everyone. I got two bingos, three bingos, four bingos, Five. I think this whole scenario is just bigger than myself. It's bigger than him, it's bigger than all of us. Like, it's crazy how he can keep a smile and his bubbly personality through it all. And I'm sure he has hard days. He's not afraid to be himself around me. He's not afraid to be vulnerable. He's not afraid to be happy. And I just love how genuine his personality and his like, emotions are. So it's easy to give those right back. Like, if I'm ever having a tough day, like, I'm not when I'm with Bobby. I forget about all of it, and it's just me and him hanging out. <laughs> you, you can tell that they love Bobby to death, and um, the interaction they have with him, you know, it just, you, you can see how it just brightens him up. On a recent sunless gray day at Arlotta Stadium, Bobby's star shined brightest when the Irish played host to Marquette. Hello. Uh oh. How are ya? You ready that, for Bobby? a big day? It's game, what day is it? Game day. Yeah, it's game day! We got him a jersey, uh, and thankfully he got to sit next to me in the locker room. Ah. You ready? Whoa. You ready, two, five? Yep. Here we go. Let's get in the circle. He got to be part of our team chat, our game plan. Irish on three, one, two, three. Irish! <laughs> He is incredible. I don't know if he has two left feet or what, but he is he, he has some moves. He's probably better than I am at dancing. But he also just has a lot of fun, which I think is why people should dance in the first place. You ready? Hit the side, hit the side. It's like, go Irish. It, it, just, it just amazes me that, you know, all he can go through and the energy and the spirit that he has. It, it's just, it's unreal. Starting out our starting lineup today. Our new teammates. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of puts everything in perspective for us as athletes. Um, they're fighting for their lives. We're just fighting for some wins and some national titles, but it's pretty cool to see, even at really young ages, how much fight and like the will to win that they have. I think he, uh, he definitely needs to remember the support and love that came out. We are fighting for life. We are the Fighting Irish.